The weather has been so kind to us, it's been nice and dry. It's allowed the integrity of the hole to stay in place. If it was wet, this clay would just turn to slush and uh, there's no way we could dig down like this. But as it's so dry, it's almost tempting to, you could almost abandon the idea of building a concrete wall and just sculpt what we've got, the clay. But the situation could change very quickly if it rained, so I think it's best to pursue the idea of making a, a one meter high concrete wall. I've made an important tool. I've drilled a hole through the cap of a plastic bottle and pushed in some 6mm diameter aquarium air pipe. I've also put a hole in the base to let air in. This is going to measure my levels. Barry's not convinced though. Okay, now will it work? Barry the skeptic. Oh, yeah, is it going to be accurate? Well, we can just tell by looking at this, can't we? Okay, that's about. The length of that is about 5 metres. Millimetre accuracy. Yeah, it's not over five metres, it's only over the width of that. <laughs> what do you mean? What? What are you saying? Gravity is not going to work over this part of the pool, but it is over this part. It's going to be different. Well, gravity is different in different areas, isn't it? Oh, my goodness. Of course, I have to remember Barry's in his 70s and is far happier with a rotating prism laser level. Okay, that's level with the top of the peg.